Hello everyone. In today's video, we are going to see some new features available with permission sets and permission set groups. Like all of you know, previously, whenever we need to implement security, everything was based on profiles. But now, the suggestion from sales source is to move towards permission sets and permission set groups. So, based on the persona, you need to create permission set groups and each of the permission set groups will be assigned with specific permission sets which is assigned for a specific functionality. So let us consider a scenario where we need to control the access of sales team in our org. So for this purpose, I created two permission set groups. Let us see that. One for sales manager and one for sales rep. And what is our expectation is sales manager should have create permission and sales rep should have edit permission on opportunities. For that, first I created some permission sets to satisfy this access requirement. So here you can see I created three permission set. One permission set will be handling the create permission on opportunity and second will be handling edit permission and the third permission set will be handling modify all. Maybe I can open the opportunity create permission set and I can show you the access available as part of this particular permission set. So let us go to object settings and look for opportunity. You can see this permission set has read, create and edit permission on opportunity. So now let us see to permission set groups how it is getting assigned. So like I mentioned sales manager should have create permission for that to the permission set group i assigned create opportunity permission set and for the sales rep let us go and see the permission set assigned to him so I already mentioned like you know he does not need create permission he just need read and edit so I just assigned opportunity edit permission to sales rep permission set group now my recommend is that temporarily sales manager should have modify all permission and for opportunity the OWD you can see I have given it as private that means sales Manager can see only opportunities to which he is having ownership or uh, the sharing is granted to him. So in another window, I actually logged in as a sales manager. And if you go and see all the opportunities, you can see he does not have access to any of the opportunities because the OWD is private. Now, I want to give him modify all permission. Like you have seen, there is a permission set already created with modify all permission. Let me just open that. So, there are a couple of options by which you can give sales manager modify all permission temporarily. So, suppose I just want to give this permission to this user for one week. So, how you will be able to do that. There are a couple of options like I told you. The first option is that to the user directly, you will be able to assign this permission set. For that, what we can do is click on opportunity modify all. And we will be getting manage assignment option. So once you click on manage assignments, you can add assignment. And you can see two users here. One is John Doe and my own username. So John Doe is the sales manager. So let us select his user and you can click on next. And before completing the assignment, you will be able to see something here. Select an expiration option for assigned users. At this moment, there is nothing selected, but we will be able to mention an assignment period. For example, to sales manager, I just want to give permission for just one week. In that case, I can select one week and click on assign. And remember, 
this option is available only if you select this under user management settings so i can quickly show you go to user management settings and here you can see permission set and permission set group assignments with expiration date if this feature is enabled we will be able to set this option during assignment i am clicking on done so now you can see john doe is assigned with this particular mode opportunity modify all permission set with a one week validity now let us go back to this particular user that is sales manager refresh and see if he is having visibility to all the opportunities yes now you can see he got visibility to all the opportunities and he will be able to edit a specific opportunity also so this is one of the option now let us see another option by which you will be able to give temporary modify all permission for that let me go back and remove this particular permission set from the user so i am removing it just to verify that it got successfully removed let me refresh the logged in screen of sales manager that is john do and uh, you can see that the access is gone now the second feature is that muting permission set that means you will be able to temporarily or you know you can remove a permission from a particular permission set group so in the second as uh, second approach what i am going to do is to the sales manager permission set group itself i am going to add the modify all permission okay i just opened sales manager permission set group and let me add the corresponding permission set let me select opportunity modify all add it it's done so let us refresh the screen and see now you can see he ho he got access to all the opportunities and now suppose we want to give this for one day only for a specific purpose once that is done you would like to revoke the access so instead of removing it if you want to temporarily remove the access what you will be able to do is there is a feature called muting permission set so corresponding to each permission set group you will be able to create a muting permission set for that you can open the permission set group go to muting permission set in group and click on new so a new muting permission set will be created now you can open this and go to object settings what we need to mute is the view all and edit all permission available as part of opportunity so go to opportunity object you can edit this and click muted on view all and modify all save this this means that the view all and modify all permission is no longer available to the sales manager permission set group let us go back and see if this is in effect already for that let us go back to the sales manager screen refresh and see if he still has access to the opportunity that we just opened so you can see that that got removed already so this is another way of handling temporarily access to particular feature in a permission set group or a particular permission set now let us see another feature of permission sets which is available as part of winter 23 release i guess this is in beta version so till this time when you are creating a new object 
the option is available option available is to just add this to profiles but now we have got a new feature available which definitely you need to enable as part of user management settings which is to enable field level security for permission sets during field creation this is a beta version meaning when you create a new field i enabled this already so better let us go back and uh, try to create a new field under opportunity so let me go to object manager open opportunity field creation new let us create a text field and naming it as con country once you click on next here you can see instead of profiles it's now showing all the permission sets that i have created in my all so you will be able to select to which all permission set you need to give read and edit access here to create edit and modify all permission set i am giving visibility for this new field so you just you need to take care that if you are utilizing both profiles and permission sets then by enabling this option you won't be getting the option to add field to permission sorry profiles anymore but if you are completely into permission sets and permission set groups this is definitely going to be a good feature for us now let us go and see one tool that salesforce relays to support management of permission sets and permission set groups you will be able to install this from app exchange and you can see this is a salesforce lab product user access and permissions assistant so there are a set of settings that you need to do in your org including a connected app setup and giving some permissions once that is done and the application is installed it is going to available as a new application called user access and permissions assistant so let us open this app and you can see there are four different features available with this particular app one is permissions as analyzer converter report and manage let us see what each of the tab is you doing earlier whenever you need to manage a permission set or you want to see like a user is assigned with which all permission sets or a particular permission set is available to which all users you had to run multiple queries and get the details it is not at all easy if you want to see everything together so that issue is resolved by this particular tool here you can see you can do search or of a particular permission or a particular user what are the permissions available so you will be able to analyze by user permission or permission sets set groups so let us start by user and let me select a user here so let us select the sales manager itself and here in the permissions for john doe you will be able to see everything got listed now and also you can see the profile assigned to this particular user is sales profile and you will be able to see all the details including standard objects custom objects set up entity access user permissions so whatever permissions that is assigned to this particular user everything will be listed here and uh, you can see an information tab uh, icon here once you click on that you will be able to see from where this particular user is getting this particular permission here you can see the permission is coming from a profile so these are some of the analysis you will be able to do by selecting a particular user and uh, standard objects if i want to see what is the permission assigned with opportunity you can just expand this and see the access now we can see he has got create read edit and delete permissions when you click on read you can see it is coming from two places one is through the profile and one is through the sales manager permission set group that we assigned so like this way you will be able to analyze the permissions assigned to a particular user now if i open permission set groups you can see all the permission set available as part of our org 
and permission if you select permission you will be able to select a specific permission is available to the selected user or not you can see active orders i selected the permission activate orders and you can see it is available just to my own user in this way you will be able to analyze all the different permissions available in your system for a particular user or based on a user based on a permission or based on a permission set group this is the first option available with this particular app the second option is converter so if you would like to move away from profiles and modify that to permission set groups and permission permission sets here is an option available to convert that so you will be able to select a particular uh, profile and you will be able to click on convert to permission set and that is going to create a corresponding permission set with all the permissions from the profile to the permission set third option is report that is if you would like to report on the different permissions available in your system you will be able to utilize this particular report tab it might take some time to load initially but once it is you loaded again you here you will be able to report by a particular user per particular permission set or per particular permission set dependency for example if you are selecting a permission set here and we want to see uh, object permissions for opportunity create then you can click on run report you need to basically select the object also here so let me select opportunity and run report again so go to object permissions you can see for opportunity create uh, for opportunity object you are having create read and edit similarly you can modify your select options and you will be able to get the details of all the different permissions available in your system and you will be able to report on that and the last option which is again the most one of the most useful option with this tool is to manage so you will be able to manage assignments removal of permission set for particular users and create you will be able to even create new permission set and assign users to that mutation muting permission set everything you will be able to handle from here so manage options you have got two things available here one is assignments and one is permission set group permission set already you have seen you will be able to create permission set groups and if you go to assignments there are two options available like assign permission set to group uh, group through users or unassign so if you click on unassign uh, suppose sales manager you selected and if you want to remove the sales manager group assignment to john doe you can select john doe click on next and you will be able to unassign so this is a really handy tool available to manage everything related to permission set permission set groups and assignments i hope this video was helpful thank you